Ich bin hier los, der Junge. Today I'm hanging out with my buddy Jeffrey. Besides a nice barbecue, we're going to get my bike ready for Let Us Out. Jeffrey's coming along for this trip and he has some idea of what to expect. It's hardly his first go on these mountains. We're inserting some pink long and hard puppies a tire insert that protects the rims, it's lighter and cheaper than Kushcore, where Kushcore is stronger, heavier and more expensive. For the regular mortal puppies will do, and for all you maniacs out there you might need to consider Kushcore. First, we need to get the rims ready. I knew they needed some TLC, but man was I in for a nasty surprise. First, the basics though, getting the tires off, cleaning the rims a bit and straightening the wheels. So let's dive in. Peppies need different valves. The air needs to come from the side. It's logical when you think about it, but the thought didn't even cross my mind. This piece of machinery still feels like sorcery to me. First you make sure the rim is straight, then you check with the tension meter if the tension is evenly distributed, and then hopefully you get everything right. But like I said, it still feels like sorcery to me. While working on the wheels, we noticed they were in a bad state. The bearings were completely shut and you could feel the grind as you turned the hubs. They needed replacing for sure, the body of the hub was finished too, the spokes were bent, a full rebuild of the wheels was in order. Jeffrey started from scratch and he did the whole job himself. No video about that unfortunately, but my wheels are never better than they are right now. Maar is er verschil tussen Puppy en Kushcore? Kushcore is veel harder en zwaarder en uh, dus ook eigenlijk sterker. So now we're done with the front wheel, it's time to do the rear wheel too. It needs some love and tender care. Getting the cassette off was no joke. We did eventually manage, but it was carnage and I will spare you the details. Since we were planning on rebuilding the wheel, we didn't really care at this point. Yeah, eh? Yeah. 
Everybody says it's hard with SRAM, but with the right tools it's a walk in the park. We needed to adjust the calipers as well. It's nice to have friends who know what they're doing. And that just shows you what a lovely community the mountain bike community is. So I hope you had fun watching this video. It was far from a tutorial on how to install puppies, but it's just one step closer to get me to the Alps. So I hope you're coming along with me on this epic mountain bike trip. And until then, see you next time. Bye bye. Next time I will take my bike to the local bike shop. The last thing I need done is a service of the fork. And the local bike shop to me is a relationship in which you need to invest. Because it pays off. My local bike shop got me out of a jam more than once. But this time Jeffrey certainly is the hero of the day.